Today you'll be learning about how to prep the concepts Smoke and Flames and Bamboo Bowl. First, you will learn about Smoke and Flames prep. Smoke and Flames is a very popular concept here at Nelson. Because of this, preparation is crucial. While preparing smoke, there are four key tasks that may need to be done as the smoke prep. You could be refilling the toppings cooler, filling the condiments, preparing desserts, and then finally setting up for the upcoming meal period. The PPE you will need for this shift is an apron, cut gloves, latex gloves, and your name tag. Before beginning anything for this shift, the first thing you want to make sure of is that you have been knife trained. Remember that during any prep shift, communication between you and the cook is imperative. So always make sure that you are consistently asking your cooks questions if you are unsure with the task or finished and ready for the next. The toppings cooler is located between smoke and bamboo. To refill the toppings cooler, there is a list on the front of the cooler that shows what must be prepared before the beginning of each meal period. On the list, it shows that item you should prepare, how many of that item, and what size pan it should be put in. After prepping each item, you will put them on the cooler on the shelf where that item is labeled. While prepping to toppings, always remember to label and date each pan on the side using a label sticker, not on the top of the saran wrap. The toppings will be found in the produce cooler for the vegetables, dry stock for canned goods, and the cheese cooler for cheeses. The clean black plastic pans can be found on the shelf next to the drink station. The condiment cooler is located on the other side of the drink station, along line one. Make sure to check the produce cooler first for any already opened condiment containers. Then, after you can go to the condiment cooler for already prepped condiments. On the door, there is a list that tells you the name of the item, the number, and the placement that must be prepared before the meal period. All the condiments can be found in dry stock. Remember when opening any canned goods with the can opener, you must use two cut gloves. Rinse and recycle all the cans and plastic containers you empty. You could also be cutting and plating desserts. Remember to always wear cut gloves when plating desserts and to wash the knife immediately after you use it while still wearing the cut gloves. Desserts can be found in the thawing room on the right outside of the thawing room on the shelves. Always make sure to communicate with the cook on which dessert to cut and how many pieces that dessert should be cut in. Lastly, you will set up the concept for the next upcoming meal period. To do so, you should turn on all the warming plates, heat lamps, soup wells, and fryers 45 minutes before the meal period begins. You could also set out trivets and utensils. The cook may also ask you to fill the freezer with the items specified by the cook. Fries can be found in the blast freezer and frozen meats can be found in the main freezer next to the thawing room. Frying items could also be on your to-do list, so when doing this, always consult with the cook and remember to wear burn sleeves because the fryers can become very hot. Next, you will learn about bamboo prep. Bamboo bowl can also be one of the busiest concepts at Nelson, especially during fried chicken days. This concept emphasizes on foods such as rice, lo mein, fried chicken, spring rolls, and egg rolls. Your PPE for bamboo prep is your apron, cut gloves, latex gloves, and your name tag. Bamboo prep focuses on three main things, filling the sauces and teas, preparing the spring rolls, and finally setting up for the upcoming meal period. You could also occasionally be asked to make a wrap for that upcoming meal period. Just like smoke, communication with your cook is always crucial when participating in a prep shift, as well as making sure you are knife trained. When filling the sauces, the bowls are found under the counter next to the double warmers, and the spoons are found in the utensil drawers under the black flat tops. The unopened sauce containers can be found in the bamboo cooler in between smoke and bamboo. You can grab a new bottle from dry stock if there is none of that item in the bamboo cooler. Next, you are in charge of filling the teas. There are three different kinds of teas we use at Bamboo. A green tea, red tea, and a white tea. You will use the red pot for the red tea, the green pot for the green tea, and the black pot for the white tea. When filling the teas, you will take a mesh trap and pour about a quarter of a cup of the tea leaves into the trap, and then fill the pots with water and set them on the warmers so they can brew for 15 minutes. After they are complete, you will take the mesh trap out and dispose of the tea leaves. Next, you will prepare spring rolls. To do so, you will get out noodles, matchstick carrots, peppers, and rice wraps. You will then prepare a warm pan of water that you will dip the rice wraps in until they are soft. Then, take the wrap out of the water, lay it flat on the cutting board, and fill it with ingredients. After it is filled, you will tuck the sides in and lay them on the tray so that they are ready to be out for the next meal period. On fried chicken days, the easiest thing to do is make sure you can go back and forth between concepts while frying the chicken. The last thing you will do as bamboo prep is make sure everything is stocked and ready for the upcoming meal period. 
you will make sure that the freezer next to the teas is stocked, the rice is in the rice warmers, and the fortune cookies, sriracha, soy, and teriyaki sauce bottles are full. Once those things are done, the last thing you will do is turn on the flat tops and set out utensils and trivets for the next upcoming meal period. Frying items can be on your to-do list for bamboo also. Make sure that when doing this, you remember to wear burn sleeves. Once all your duties are done for your shift, find a student leader to check out and then you are good to go.